It was an alleged encounter in a hotel room that put Stormy Daniels at the centre of the first ever criminal trial of a former US president. In court today, she described meeting Donald Trump in Lake Tahoe, providing lurid details like the satin pyjamas he wore and how she spanked him with a magazine before they had sex. Mr Trump has always denied the encounter, but his personal lawyer, Michael Cohen, paid the adult film star nearly $200,000 to stay quiet quiet. It's that payment the former president is accused of trying to cover up. I should be out campaigning right now. The defence argued some of Ms Daniels' evidence was aimed at embarrassing Mr Trump and demanded a mistrial. The judge rejected the request. It was a very big day, a very revealing day. As you see, their case is totally falling apart. After lunch, Mr Trump's legal team began cross-examination, asking if the actress had tried to profit off the story. Am I correct that you hate President Trump? Ms Daniels was asked. She replied, yes. It's increasingly likely that of the four criminal trials Donald Trump is facing, this will be the only one that happens before November's election. His trial on charges of illegally handling classified documents was scheduled for this month, but today a Florida judge has scrapped that date and it's now postponed indefinitely. Emily Grimens, ABC News, Washington.